One day, Lori Davis and uh, Diana Loman came to the worship center to pray before our service time, and I was on the worship team that day. Um, they felt a heaviness, uh, a burden in the room, and, and I was carrying one with me that day. And um, just through conversations with friends, um, I just felt that God was talking to me that I needed to go to deliverance. I had a night where anger just exploded. And I sat down in the recliner and I was asking God what that was. And he told me, you know, it was the anger from my childhood that I had built up. And then, it, you know, deliverance came up. I felt like I was calling me to be part of uh, an urban ministry, specifically one in uh, Louisiana. And as I was talking to this lady, and it was just not working out, and it seemed like it was all on her end, God just really revealed to me that now it was, I had issues that I needed to take care of, things that um, I needed to resolve. Uh, and I'd always, or not always, but I'd felt like deliverance was something that I needed to do in the past, but it was always one of those, I don't have issues, I'm, I'm doing good, I'm a well-adjusted Christian, you know, yeah, sure, I have some problems, but basically that's for those people. Just that's when God made it abundantly clear that now I absolutely need to go to deliverance and that it's not just for those people. I, uh, this summer, was going through a lot of stuff and I had heard other testimonies from other people who had gone through deliverance. And so I felt like God was calling me, kind of pushing me um, to go through it. I knew that there was hardships and stuff I was going through that He wanted me to work out and deal with. Uh, I felt very loved and taken care of. Um, I felt like I had gained two new friends because my, this is not a coincidence, my team uh, was Lori Davis and Diana Lohman. And so those were the two ladies that um, had come into the worship center that day. And so I think that was a God thing. Um, and um, it was, the room was full of love when every time I went through a session, I had five sessions. It took a while for me. <laughs> I guess I'm slow. It was awesome. I went in thinking that I kind of knew what I was going to have to deal with and stuff. And then uh, God just kind of showed me that there was a lot more that I had like strongholds and, and stuff. And so um, I, uh, I, it was an eye opening experience. It was an experience. <laughs> it was, uh, I had five or six sessions, and uh, each one of them. It was like more and more stuff was coming out. Uh, I was getting deeper revelations of who Christ was and um, being able to release that stuff. For me, um, I was carrying some baggage of uh, just experiences from the past. And what it taught me is that um, I had put up walls and um, that I can use God's word to tear down those walls. And um, I was in chains. I was in bondage for many things. And um, God doesn't want me to live that way. Um, I've been a Christian since I was seven, but you don't always know exactly what prayers to pray or how to pray them. And uh, deliverance taught me that I can go directly to God and pray these prayers and be free. When we were going through, um, you know, asking forgiveness, or forgiveness and, and forgiving others, uh, and we get to forgiving God, that was that was a big one because I didn't realize um, even then how upset I was with God. Uh, I am worthy of His love. That was something I had to deal with was uh, from my parents, you know, I, I was rejected as a child and the uh, Holy Spirit just ministered to me in that area. So I'm very grateful for that. <laughs> it was definitely stronger. I went in wanting more intimacy with Him and a relationship with Him and uh, he revealed to me like that um, he's the provider and and I have to put all my trust in him. I've had people 
tell me that they just sense a, uh, a newness about me. A, um, I've matured. Um, I am more willing in, and I feel freer to let God work in my life and to accept the challenges He has for me. Uh, before, I had had an issue with um, acceptance, um, always feeling like I needed to earn my, my way and um, I don't feel that way anymore. I, you know, I think that's one issue that God just took away um, in my life. I am a child of His and um, always will be, and He's the one that I need to answer to and nobody else. I'm more understanding. I have more love for the family. Uh, I'm easier to communicate with. Uh, before I was very reserved and stood off to myself. Now I'm opening up and, you know, uh, God is presenting uh, opportunities for me to go out and minister to different people. Uh, yeah, it's changed my whole walk with Him. Uh, I'm in His Word more and I'm, I'm at each day striving to have a better relationship with Him. And so that's exciting and uh, it's definitely just continued on to grow. I've always been kind of cyclical in my, my faith in that, you know, I have high highs, but then I'll crash, you know, every so often, every six months, every whatever. And um, even before Deliverance, I had been starting to even that out, but the cycle's done, you know. 